can see by the look of it, it's shocked. You know? Yeah, I think the thing that pops out most is the fact that she's actually screaming. Mm. It's like, just by the fact that she's screaming, you know that something bad's gonna happen. Mm. Maybe some random stabbings. Yeah, maybe. And she's also trying to hold it with the, uh, the hand over her mouth. There's quite a feared look in her eyes as well, if you look at the eyes. Yeah, they look shocked. Probably as well, maybe the font. Because you notice the, the jagged spike at the bottom of the M has kind of reminiscence of a blade or a kind of stabbing, you know, all, all, implement. All the writing's bold, so, you know, it looks like it's, it's coming out. You know, it's, it's the main focus. Uh, I think the thing that immediately jumps out at you is the fact that your attention all seems to be drawn to that thing in the middle. Mm. No idea yeah, no idea what it is, but it looks kind of dangerous. Are those people around the outside? Yeah, those are people. Uh, I see I see how like the red is possibly uh, connoting the blood of them, maybe. That's true. It, it does seem to stand out seeing as the rest of it's pretty much in black and white and then you've got this one kind of red and then a kind of dirty Ready white in the middle as well. It seems almost like the gloom, and also the, the uh, title, the, the six, is is bold as well. So, uh, you know, like the normally by the sixth title. film, you're doing something outrageous to scare people or just mess with someone's mind. Mm. Uh, we can see, like, uh, you know, it's dark. It's it's like evil. Yeah, yeah that flashing red light's pretty evil looking. Mm. It's all ominous, and uh, also the bit at the bottom, the, the blood lines, the wheel of death. The wheel of death. actually oh uses God. the word death there. <laughs> and that's yeah. and then I'll be in the round bush there. Yeah. Also become Jigsaw's apprentice. Yeah, a bit gimmicky. The smoke as well gives a, a nice kind of mm. ominous effect to the website. And I don't know what that green thing is down there by the door. It looks yeah. like a, a bone. They also the door slightly opened. They, they you know, they're quite evil. That's true. That's always creepy when it's like flashes of like a villain or mm -hmm. something that's just generally about to kill you. As well as the intro to the website was really creepy with the yeah. kind of fast moving and screaming and it just red like occasionally. It's like a real pace to it. Mm -hmm. uh, once again, the website is dark. And uh, it also has the red in it as well. Less impressive though compared to the Scream one. Not the Scream one, the Saw one. Mm -hmm. I mean, it has like the, uh, like the main thing on it. The um, poster. Sure, and that guy that plays, you know, his name, Stu with the gun. Uh, yeah. He looks creepy and menacing. Mm -hmm. There's a sort of like little teaser of the it's also got the uh, title as well, you know, which is bring back. Yeah. Could have done better though for a horror film's website. Yeah, I mean, it does look a bit sort of straight. Does point S not really, yeah, uh, slapdash put together. We don't really care about this website. Not really focusing on uh, like background detail or anything. I definitely liked how it, it started off quite slow paced, but ominous with that guy's voice and then suddenly you get that jump to the quite fast pace and you get some tense and uh, tense and you really get a feel for like yeah you want to watch this movie yeah one thing i definitely noticed was the soundtrack it de definitely gives it that kind of creepy mm. ominous gonna stab you in the face kind of feel mm. it's, a, it's a good feel you never as well really see the killer that much. I mean, you get that one shot where he's running up the stairs and maybe one of his face. You do eventually see more of him as the trailer goes on. Yeah. Yeah, it's uh, quite, quite little with him in the trailer. As well as the flashes of words were quite powerful and pronounced and just kind of generally in your face. Yeah, and yeah that, that trailer was uh, definitely quite intense as uh, music goes. It doesn't really show much of uh, the film. All you really hear is kind of screaming, and it's almost as if you're being dragged back mm. through
through this kind of ominous building. Mm. The CG as well is uh, seeming just made for that. Mm. It means that it can be quite high budget. Uh, you know. Definitely a lot scarier because you're not actually really sure what's going on. I mean, people are screaming all around you. I mean, I'm assuming people are either being killed or tortured or hurt, but definitely a lot scarier because you don't know what's going on. It's almost if you feel like dazed and like, uh, like as you said, pulled through. Yeah, definitely. The uh, atmosphere of the building was, was excellent.